Hey everyone, I hope you guys are doing well. Now, uh, lately across uh, several car discussion forums, uh, I read about this common issue is that uh, the new car owners, uh, they are complaining that the battery is draining too quickly. And uh, some of them even telling that uh, the car refuses to start uh, if they have parked it for uh, two or three days. Now, this uh, problem is not uh, particular with Mahindra. I have come across owners of Tata as well. And also even uh, the Jeep uh, owners complaining about a similar issue. So now we are going to do a, a small test of the battery as well as the charging system. Now this test uh, can be done in the PDI to make sure that uh, you get a good battery and uh, the charging system is working efficiently so that uh, you don't uh, face these issues. Now to do the test we have a multimeter. Uh, you can get it uh, online as well as in your uh, local electronic shop. And these are pretty inexpensive. I think uh, this thing costed me about 150 rupees in the local electronic shop. Uh, now you can carry this uh, in your uh, uh, PDI or, uh, or if you have uh, your existing car, you can check the state of the battery as well as uh, charging system on that as well. So let's start. We'll put it in the volt DC section and on the 20 volt mark we're going to take the red probe which is for the positive and hook it onto the positive terminal and the black probe which is for the negative we're going to touch it on the negative terminal and the reading that comes up is 12.7 so now anything below 12 is a sign of discharged battery and around 12.2 to 12.3 volt uh, shows that the battery is just 50% charged. So ideally it should be above 12.5 volts to 12.8 volts. So as you can see that, uh, that this battery is uh, completely charged and uh, it will have uh, no problem in uh, starting the car. So now let's start the car and we'll see how is the charging system working using this multimeter. So we have started the car and uh, let's just switch off the infotainment and the AC is off and the lights are off as well. So let's uh, go and check the multimeter reading now now with the car started uh, we are looking for a reading somewhere between 13.5 uh, 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 to 14.4 volts now this is a 12 volt battery uh, so uh, anything more than 13.5 uh, indicates that the uh, charging system is working efficiently in uh, charging the battery so let's put it onto the negative terminal. And as you can see, it's above 14. So the battery at, at idle speeds, the battery is getting uh, charged. So now let's uh, uh, on the headlight and we'll on the AC as well and uh, see uh, there should not be much fluctuation. Uh, in between uh, the readings uh, so that shows that the car is uh, handling the load well uh, with all the electronics uh, running the car battery is uh, still getting charged so let's on the AC infotainment and the lights let's switch on the AC the infotainment system and lights as well will uh, increase the fan speed oh, let's even uh, switch on the light here so we have switched on the ac we have uh, switched on the headlights uh, we have uh, on the light uh, inside the cabin as well 
uh, the infotainment system is on and uh, so let's see as you can see uh, even under load uh, we're getting a reading of 14.1 so so even under load uh, the charging system is working efficiently and uh, charging the battery uh, so this is a very basic test what you can do in your uh, pdi uh, to make sure that uh, as a consumer uh, you don't get uh, cheated uh, because uh, once the car is sold from the showrooms uh, it is none of their concern and uh, you have to run to the service center uh, for any work that comes up uh, all it takes is uh, a very inexpensive device the multimeter uh, to do this test so if you guys like this video uh, and you found it useful uh, do give it a thumbs up uh, do consider subscribing for more such content and uh, share this with anyone uh, who is buying a new car or is having issues uh, with their battery uh, this is quite an easy test and it hardly takes a minute or two to do so anyways uh, if you like the content uh, do consider subscribing to this channel for more such content and i'll see you on the